previously. Master Murai, the Hayabusa village. Master Ryu. So today is May 21st, 2019. We're back at it again with Ninja Guiding Black. This is part two, chapter two, the Hayabusa Ninja Village. Now in the last video, I asked some friends of mine, yo, what do I need to do to make the, you know, the Let's Plays better and such? People told me, flip the damn camera. It would be better if you make the picture of yourself bigger. The video was cool and all, but you need more of that energy. What more do you want from me? But anyways, man, uh, before before I ramble on some more, let's get on to chapter two. Let's find out what's going on in the village, and we're gonna have a great time, right? Yeah? All right, whatever, let's go. All right, so we gotta go all the way back where we came from to find out what's going on in Ryu's village or whatnot. You know, at this moment like this, this is basically what you're doing. You're backtracking everything you've done from the previous chapter and you're going on to where you need to go to now. I'm just running through every little fucking room <laughs> to get to where I need to get to. All right, now we got over here and now the door is freaking open. Now we're at the Altair and just find out what, what we need to do next. So we got the art of wherever the hell it is. Now we're trying to go down wherever the hell we're trying to get down to. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Bro, okay. Uh, let me just try to jump down there and see what we need to do. Uh, nothing, there's a freaking hole in the ground. And, <laughs> all right, run up the wall, run up the wall, run up the wall. Okay, I'm just running around like a dumbass and not know what the fuck I'm trying to do. All right, so the lady told me in the damn tutorial that I need to run across the wall. Boom, there we go. All right, cool. Smoke bombs. I don't know what they're for, but I'm pretty sure we'll find out as soon as we get to the battle. Oh shit! Hey, hold up, man. I've been practicing. Oh, oh, oh shit! You trying to get? Uh, uh. No, you're not. No, you, no, you will not. You will not, bitch. Bro, oh my fucking. Nah. Off with your goddamn head. Oh, oh, oh my god, you fucked that up. You had one job, Mr. Static. You had one job. You could have made a cool moment, you fucked it up. Bruh, how did you get up the damn. What the fuck? How do you get up in this damn thing? Yo, oh my god, man. This. The camera is so damn terrible. Oh, how do you get. Oh my fucking god. How do you get up, man? For real. There we go. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to commentate and try to fight these dudes at the same time. But sometimes they are so unpredictable. You get your ass put every now and then. So I need to focus. As I was saying, sometimes when you try to fight these guys, it's kind of hard to commentate and at the same time. Because this is very. Oh, okay. I am so trash at trying to commentate and fight at the same time. It is not, it is not, <laughs> I wouldn't recommend it. Or maybe I need a little more practice at it just so I can get better at it at the same time and not get confused while I'm trying to fight these guys. All right, so now we're continuing to running. I hope I'm close to the damn, oh my God, why is, why? Let me guess. Oh man, the thing that's pissing me off about this game right now, I'm already complaining. Like the swimming is so trashed, and what what doesn't even what doesn't even help is the camera doesn't even help the situation either. Run towards the water, and as you reach it, press the jump button repeatedly. This allows you to run across the surface. What? This didn't do. This didn't do a damn thing. I literally thought we was gonna do some like Naruto running on the water chakra, not that, that type of thing. I thought we was literally gonna walk on water like with Jesus Christ. 
this is okay we're in the hayabusa village now we gotta find out what's going on here as i was saying earlier i'm trying to figure out the controls again because i haven't played this game in a very long time so like revisiting the gameplay moments and everything like that oh my goodness it's gonna take me some getting used to trying to get used to controls too and it doesn't freaking help that the camera is pretty bad i don't know who came up with the game design as such it's like if you want to have a free flow camera and everything you know that's fine but it'd be nice if i could just look around and such with the right thumbstick like every time i press it it just goes straight into first person like what the fuck man uh it just it would have been simple it's like i'm playing mario 64. at least give me like a like a camera that follows me and then you know at least i can get a what the fuck? hey my homie i was trying to explain what's going on so i can you know my frustrations and whatnot hold up excuse me as i fight these fools oh shit! these guys are everywhere hold up do I got any hills or anything? I don't want to die just yet. <laughs> I want to. I want to fight with all. Oh my god! All right, we got. We killed all those guys. Jesus! All right, so we need to go ahead and continue find out what's going on in this village. Okay, so I'm doing some investigations. It's his friend. A dark samurai clad in black armor. Master, you do not attempt to fight it. She got a bow. I could have sworn she was just with us in the last chapter. How'd she get here so fast? Oh shit! The oh, fuck? What the hell? Oh my, oh my god! Dude! Okay, I'm trying. This this game is very unpredictable. Dude! Oh my god! Oh shit! I'm alive. What? What the fuck? So before I fight this guy, I want to make sure that we collect whatever we need to collect first before we go fight that guy. Because like I said before, I don't want to leave any room unchecked because you leave rooms unchecked, you're pretty much messing out on goods that you might need for later. Yeah, this is the part we have to fight this guy. Uh, I think I hated this part as a kid. I fuck. Uh, fuck. I think I'm supposed. To yeah. I think I remember this shit. Yeah, I think I'm supposed to get my bow and arrow and shoot this dude off there. Cause it's gonna be if I if I don't shoot this dude off the horse, it's gonna be a pain. It's gonna be a pain in the ass. I can already tell. Jesus Christ, who, who the hell designed this fucking kids game mechanic? Oh my god. Okay, we finally got rid of those guys, so now I gotta progress a little forward, find what we need to do next. Alright, so I'm just gonna head explore, because like I said before, we don't leave any rooms unchecked, so we gotta find out what we need to do first. Right. It's like the more I play this game, it's like stuff is coming back to me. I think at some point we might backtrack into this area, because some games, if I don't, hold up, I think this is like a teleporter or something. 
I don't know. I think I think it has to be or something. But don't tell me right now if you're watching this video if you have played this game because don't spoil anything for me. I want I wanted to make sure it comes back to me. I want to make sure I'm right when it, if it does happen or so. If it don't happen, I mean I, I hope that L. But I just want to make sure that my predictions are right. Well, since there's nothing over up top, let's go ahead and go this way. I think this area is where the real boss fight begins. Yep. Oh, this is gonna be a pain in the ass. Let's go, bitch. What the f- Oh my god, not these motherfuckers. Bitch, get off me. Bitch, get the fuck off me. No! Oh my god, damn. Dude. Dude, this the camera is trash. What the fuck? Fuck you. That was a pain in the that was a pain in the ass. I I had I had to get quiet and focus on killing that dude. For real. Alright. So I can't go back that way, so let's go ahead and go forward. All right, so that's the end of chapter two, part two. Uh, what the hell were you thinking, Ryu? I mean, from a viewer's perspective, we know you wasn't ready. I mean, I knew you wasn't ready. What makes you think you was gonna take down that guy? Who knows, honestly, it's probably just for character development, obviously, so we, we could face him again. But that dude, I was like, as soon as he turned around and he had that little hollow thing, that smoke around his face, I was like, bruh, like, come on. And then he put the face mask on, I'm like, oh, that's gonna make anything better, but whatever, I'm just nitpicking. So anyways, um, if you guys enjoyed the video, uh, please do yourself a favor, hitting the like button, I greatly appreciate that. Um, comment on the video, what you like and didn't like, you want to give me feedback, I greatly appreciate it as well. I try to improve over time, so your feedback will help me con you know, continue to improve. That's all I really care for at this point.
I mean, I, I mean, I don't mind if you watch with videos or whatever. I mean, it helps me out too. So, <laughs> and also, don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss any more content. And also, after you subscribe, uh, subscribe. What the fuck am I saying? Subscribe. Uh, just make sure you hit the notification bell so that every time I drop a new video. It'll notify you on your phone or whatever else you use for your devices, email, all that great jazz. And also, too, also have a main channel, upload reviews, such as Resident Evil, Mortal Kombat, and more stuff that's going to come. So, anyways, before me, continue to ramble on a bit more. Hope you all have an awesome day, and I'll see y'all next time. Signing out.